Hey guys, welcome back to Stocks In, where we talk about stocks, stocks, and yes, we got it, more stocks. And if you love crypto and you like making money, click the links in the description box down below, one of which is the Patreon link, where you go over there and get this course for over 24 hour access. You know what I'm buying, you know what I'm selling in crypto and in the stocks. Let's get into it, guys. We're going to do a market overview of a cryptocurrency market as of the date of this video. Um, we'll just get notifications there about uh, Chili's market I'm showing up there as of this video is red and it's red for for obvious reasons let's just get it up on the screen there there we go so Bitcoin is down 3% we're looking at maybe recovery there Ether they're holding out and um, they're waiting for that huge upgrade that's coming in July and I just see great things happen for Ether we have it in our portfolio crypto assets and um, portfolio and um, videos are there let's look at the Bitcoin chart last 24 hours it's super bullish because when I go out further and you see notifications come over the screen there as we go along and um, if I come out further to the seven day chart let's give that a uh, happy face we can see we're back where we were back on the 13th of March basically so it's kind of like up down going to a harmonica uh, chart there on that one and if we come out there to the two weeks chart doing this anymore is super bullish the line is just pointing upwards we're looking at that if that line goes cut right through we're gonna maybe 65,000 in a week or two right down there i'm actually drawing the line um on the screen there from the 6th of march low point to the left side of the screen there straight up that's what i'm looking at you can do another line there as well from the 16th of march straight across towards 70,000 and maybe 80,000 preferably a um, market there so back out to the 24 hour chart let's go back in into ether we're going to go ether now is the market run down and let's just open up that there for those of you who are new to cryptocurrency. So the uh, update is going to come and at the moment there's a network update there. Berlin will be rolled out at block 12.244.00 and that's estimated April 14, 2021. Miners and node operators will need to update their clients to the latest version. If you are holding either in your own wallet or exchange, there's nothing for you to do. Okay, and then more information is there for the Berlin update. Again, that 24 hour, I'm um, happy face. That 24 hour chart looks extremely bearish and a lot of noobs out there in the cryptocurrency scene will be selling right now. We've come out to the seven day chart. It tells a different story. We're back at the 13th of March, and this is a pattern we're talking about here, and I'm going to be going through that later on in the video. Just an explanation as how cryptocurrencies differ from the stocks. And um, this video was raw. There's no green screens or CGI's effects in this video. Again, two week chart. You do you see that? I can go to the 6th of March and put a line right through that right up to 2200 and um, that's what i'm looking at around the time of this upgrade in july uh let's go to our next coin we have in our portfolio ada ada a huge uh, opportunity here for new investors again extremely bearish for the fact that i had a ground there at around about 139 140 and apparently a massive dump so to speak Again, as the time of this video is not listed on Coinbase, it's on Coinbase Pro, but not on Coinbase Live. Seven day chart there. It's a different story. It's completely bullish. If you look at the 13th of March to where we are right now, the lines don't meet like Bitcoin and Ether. Um, extremely bullish. Let's look at the two week chart there for um, ADA. And we're back at around the 6th of March, if you look at that. We're going, we're going back further. Um, so we've hit that point uh, once, twice, three times, four times we've hit it in the last 
two weeks at this point we're on now 124 it it is it, if you go on averages it, it is um, a base that we're making <clears throat> and again i'm extremely bullish on this my patrons are so happy to be in it and they're happy to be anything that i'm in but extremely happy with ada and um, some of us have been under 20 cents i make it clear i'm in there since 10 a few patrons in there 13 14 uh, some are 17 it's extreme and um, proportional gains we're making we're looking at 250 here with the coinbase um pump so to speak it's not a pump and dump but the you know the coinbase pr um 24 hour chart there we're looking at a price target of maybe five dollars by the end of the year i, I can i can go to 50 and um, there was a coin that came out there alice it went up 60,000 percent in a matter of minutes. However, um, anything is the limit here with ADA. Um, Fifty dollars would be a fantastic um, selling opportunity for us in the patrons, so we can you know buy some of Bitcoin and Ether. Um, but yeah, I'm extremely bullish with um, ADA. Polka dot, polka dot. Well, look, a chart speaks for itself. Twenty-four hour chart. We we'll go to the seven day charts and we're back at the 13th of March. Um, the, the coins that are more established will have this pattern uh, as we go on with the marker rundown. Uh, we're, we're creating a base here for polka dot and for me the, the, the base is the point we're on right now, around about 35 uh, dollar mark, we just hit 35 there now. That's um, the base for polka dot. And if we just go out for the month chart again, it is an extremely bullish chart here. We're trying to break the $35 mark, three months chart. I'm going in depth to this one because this has to be noted. Three months ago, it was under $10. And uh, that's the point when uh, I got in myself. And if we go up to the month chart there again, it, it's an extreme bullish. It's, it's trying to break through resistance. Resistance is there and has been met. We did go to our high of $42 and immediately a uh, sell off came. We haven't recovered since, but the point we're on right now is 22nd of February. And um, if you have a time machine, basically we're traveling back in time with a lot of these uh, market prices at the moment. XRP, um, <clears throat> XRP. Um, we're going to go and give it a happy face. It's it's a coin that I'm getting interest on, and the Patreons are aware of it. Um, I've made them aware that XRP is not moving, and it will not be moving um, until the court case is being finalised. And there's nothing else to say about that. Um, everything is out there in the open, what Ripple are doing with the Western Union deals, MoneyGram deal, um, they sold that one off. Um, it, 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 it's a coin that will become a global standard. However, at this moment in time, it's a coin to get interest on because the price is not changing. A seven day chart there, as you can see, the price is not changing. So you'd rather get interest on your XRP than holding it on the exchange. And that's what we're doing in the Patreon. Um, and we can see there, 16th of March, there was a, a, a movement on it. However, it, it was kind of a manipulated move. Um, one of the old OGs that actually left uh, Ripple is um, basically dumping um, XRP. It was according to his uh, NDA agreement. Um, but nothing really has to say about XRP, really. Um, I didn't touch on Binance. So we, um, we're not going to touch on that. And obviously, uh, USDT speaks for itself. Uniswap, a new coin added to our portfolio. Again, it's a fantastic coin to be in for various reasons. The logo, the fact that it's uh, working for feminism out there and power to all women out there. It's a fantastic coin and to be in, in for, uh, you know, you want to support the women. Um, it, it, it's a definitely, definitely super, super bullish. If we just come back out there to 24 hour charts, again, it, it, it's, it's fairly bearish, but if we go to the week chart, we're just back at the 12th of March. Um, 
and we've touched that point on once, twice, three times, four times, five times we've touched that point on where we are in the right now. And if we come out more a bit again, we can see there the start of March is where we kicked off at the $30. Come back to a month as well, by the 22nd of February, touched on $30 too. It's um, whew, definitely resistance is um, $30. Uh, I don't see no movement on Uniswap as of yet, but I, I do see like you know a three percent swing again. So if you just zoom out again, we can just see the seventeenth of March, the eighteenth of March. It went down, went up. I do see that a lot of that patterns happening. However, upward trend, we can touch thirty five dollars by the end of the month. Um, we've come out there to light coin again, mirror coin in our portfolio. Again, I touched on uh, two ten there in the week, and two thirty there um, in the last week as well, fourteenth of March. Again, like all the other coins, it is down at the moment. Come out to the two week chart, extremely bullish. We've touched on that two thirty, um, and we're going to go back there. Uh, the, the point is how long it will take, and if we come to the month chart. We can see there in the middle of February we touched on what we touched in the 14th of Feb March. So a whole month it has taken for those who got into light kind of 240, 244. Uh, you got that back there around about 230, under 230 there the 14th of March. We still haven't got back to that high. We're down 20% uh, from that high in February. Um, I see us going back there again. Look at the three month chart just to see the graph. And um, if we go to the 30 December, when we cut through, we're probably looking at maybe around about April. We can get back to 220. Um, again, we, we're, gonna, we're gonna see a lot of sell offs. Um, we're in the middle of one right now, according to the uh, chart for a light coin. But around about April, and it's, it's a chart that's easily studied. Uh, give a happy face. Um, so Litecoin is definitely one to look out for. We go further down the list. Luna is actually making a lot of uh, uh, eyes turn, uh, so to speak. Uh, Crypto.com coin. Crypto.com coin three months ago was down at five cents, four cents. Um, I'm not getting in it right now. We're gonna give it a happy face. Look, they're doing massive things. They're doing a three month chart there, o over 200%. Um, these exchange coins are to be um, made aware of. You know, um, I don't get into coins just because of the hype or whatever. I get into coins um, that have a purpose and have a meaning and that's why I'm going through the market run down here with you so you can see the coins that we are in and why we're in them. VeChain is a coin I'm looking at. Super bullish about this coin. However, I feel like it is still overpriced. I feel it should go back to its price that it was at the start of March, around about 5 cents. It's a fantastic breaking in point to get into. If we go to the month chart on feed chain, we're like where we are right now, it's on a crossroads. So it's either going to go and break through the resistance with the fact that the market is a bit bearish, so to speak, or it's going to come down. And I think it's going to come down to around about six, five cents in the next week or so. I don't see any uh, indications there to tell me that it won't do otherwise. And when it does, uh, believe you me, um, those in Patreon will know about it straight away. Uh, Ravencoin. Ravencoin is um, a one that really has kicked off the community here. It's a coin that we're in, we're happy to be in, and we are continuing to buy in. Um, it's to be noted though, there's no agenda against the community in Ravencoin. However, they are very toxic, um, and for anyone that's new into crypto, um, beware of communities, any community for that word. Um, I don't have any issue against any singular community out there. Uh, again, um, there's a lot of trolls everywhere, so just be careful of them indeed. If we go out there to the month chart, 
we are super bear, bullish on um, I knew you said bearish uh, on uh, Raven coin. Well, if we look at a seven day chart, um, and the reason why it's breaking in is NFTs and the blockchain itself, and the fact that it can move and break the chains, as I mentioned, from Bitcoin and Ether and move on its own pace, and which it has done. If you come out there, look at up nearly 20%, 40% in the last two weeks. We're talking about nearly touching on 200% in the last month, in the last 60 days, uh, around the time I'm in, over a thousand percent. Um, look, uh, you know, Raven coin is going to go up from here. Um, I see, definitely see Dublin in price. Uh, we'll go to the two-week chart there. Fantastic base. And you see the base sets in for like three, four days before it goes. You see the base there just settles in and then just goes up. And if we look at the 10th of March to the 16th of March, it was on that 18 uh, cents um, and then went up. A little sell off this one because it, it was a huge um, um, bounce there for Ravencoin from 18 cents right up to the high uh, mid 20, 25, 26 cents and a sell off then down to around about 21 cents and went back up again, back up, straight away back up to 25 cents, which I wanna see. Uh, from my coins and went down now it's on a bit of a, a downward spiral down to about 20 cents which we are right now we're going to recover and go to the month chart on raven coin it, we we have been on this in, in uh, end of february and it's a it's a pattern i said it to you start a video it's a huge pattern we're seeing in the crypto market right now it's a discounted um market because if we didn't have the pullbacks from various um, media outlets, uh, we could be on 50 cents by now. Um, and that, you've come out to the three month chart where you can see it there for um, Ravencoin. The huge um, um, turn of events for Ravencoin. Uh, it's just remarkable what they're doing there. Uh, fully support what they're doing, and they're definitely going to be the um, next gen uh, crypto 100%. Again, now is the time to get into Ravencoin before this thing pops. And believe you me, it will be popping. Um, Chili's, I uh, have your face on that one. Chili's, you see the pattern of Chili's compared to the other coins. It doesn't work like that. Chili's is a sports fan token. Anytime there's a sports fence on, Chili's is going to be popping. And believe you me, this is the coin you want to be in before it definitely gets to a dollar. Because when it gets to a dollar, the resistance is gone. And before you know it, it's gone 5, 10. Uh, $25. Last 24 hours charts again, it is up and look at that numbers there. Unbelievable. For those who are in over a year, fantastic. Uh, we're in in the last 30 days and whoa, like those numbers are absolutely remarkable. Last week, it, it, it's kind of a side of our pattern and um, we're on this again 13th of March where we are right now. We were loving it there um, around about the 14th where it, we were going on a dollar. It touched 90 and um, it was a test and uh, we're going back. We are going back there indeed. If you come out there to the month chart again, absolutely unbelievable what Chili's are doing. Deals are coming, Formula One, NASCAR, Premiership, um, and various football clubs I've mentioned in Chili's video. Uh, this coin um, is deserving of where it is. I believe it's 30, 34 now. Um, it can easily get top 30 very soon, and there's a lot of coins in between it. But um, look, this is the coin you want to be in. Next coin we are in, and there's a video that will be coming up uh, on um, the channel, Pundi X. Uh, I'm in Pundi X actually three months. Um, and I got in there around about the 10th of February um, and I'm getting rewarded for it, definitely. Um, and the numbers don't lie, they really doesn't. This is a coin that goes against the grain like Raven coin. It has its own place. I love the X Pass card, which I will get into in, in, in the Punda X video. Again, I love the fact that if you look at the 27th of December, to the 13th of January, we were on a base, went up on a base on the 13th of January to the 10th of February, one month at that base, up, then a couple of days, then at that base, up again, 
a bit of up and down harmonica and then from the 24th of February till the 10th of March we were on that point and now go to two week chart now from 10th of February, 10th of March excuse me to the 14th of March we're on a bass and up and then a little bit of up 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 again then from the 16th of March to the 18th of March we were at that price point a week ago and now where we are right now 24 hour chart we're on all time highs um, and just to clarify that for you the all time high date was actually um, 2018 actually um, but in the last few two weeks we're on an all time high I just want to make that clear we're down on an all time high um, 60, 67 uh, percent and uh, um, down on one cent um, it's going to get back there, it really is, and that was just, was just um, something there that kind of blew me off a bit. Um, look, it, it is a, it's on a 52 week high, and you know, I don't want to really get into too much in this video, but definitely it, it's, a, it's a gem to be in, definitely it really is. Next coin uh, we're looking at here is Hots, and uh, it, it's... Um, it's another it's another great one it's another great one i'm coming out to the three month chart this time i'm in it and there's definitely what i love to see from these coins that are really low prices there's a great base before it jumps up and it creates a base right now we're on the 24 hour chart and we have to come out to the seven day chart to see where we're at right now with um hots and we're on a base right now before we go up to uh, one cent Next coin I'm looking at is Harmony One, and the boys at the Patreon love this coin, and I love this coin too. And I mean this coin massively. And um, if you look at the charts there, it's a, a remarkable charts we're looking at here with Harmony uh, One. It's just creating harmony, peace and harmony. And if, if we come out there to the seven day chart, it, it, it's not creating a base. And the reason why it's not creating the base, if we come out to the one month chart, that is why it's not creating the base. Because we're still finding ourselves with Harmony One. What is the best place to put us at? And I feel the best place to put Harmony would be on 25 um, cents. And the reason being is because we're on number one, obviously. We're on an all time high. We're in the middle of an all time high. And number two is the fact that the market is extremely bullish. And if you see the three month chart, even if you go to the three month chart as well, we didn't see these kind of patterns uh, since the 11th of February uh, to the week of the 18th of February, where we were up and down, up and down the harmonica. If you look at the one month chart there, we might, we might see it more in detail. Um, not really much there at the 18th of February, 26th of February. But where we are right now with Harmony, we're finding ground, ground, excuse me, and it, the only way is up. And if you look at the 24 hour chart, the only way is up. We're up 21% already. Um, and it's a coin that uh, we're in long and we'll be holding it long. Um, a couple of other coins that I do have on my watch list there. And the, 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 um, the coins that are there, they're there for reasons. Now, you, you probably would have seen one there. I just put it in there just to put it in. But I want to make it clear that we're not in any mean coins and um, I don't I don't publicize mean coins on this channel. Uh, the global market cap is 1.8 trillion. We're on this um, target that we're on now for the last, uh, ooh, <clears throat> I would say, just on the last two weeks. Um, we need to break this 1.8 trillion mark and I believe we can. Um, it's just all the matters is where we're down two percent on the market cap. Uh, Bitcoin fifty nine point three five percent, Ether eleven point three five percent, Binance Coin two point two four percent, and others are twenty seven percent. So, um, Ether's um, grasp we're at twelve cent uh, twelve percent. Excuse me, with them um, for a week, and now they're down to eleven. Look guys, the whole point, what I'm trying to say is, from the, looking at the Bitcoin chart, 
and the Ethereum chart is that it's a chart that is very, very bullish. I'm just getting the last rundown of this video is stocks, crypto, how do you balance it out? Well, right now we're in the middle of a, a six week plan that was extended and extended to just the fact that the stock market is extremely bearish right now. Um, all stocks are red for various reasons that I spoke about already in this channel. And what we're doing is to overcome that uh, red is that we're in crypto assets. In uh, one of my other videos, you can check it out, we're in the crypto assets, so we're in the blockchain, we're in the mining companies and we're in them really big. And they are giving us returns, um, a bit like uh, volatility, but however, we're trying to beat the market and we are beating the market. We're beating the market crypto and in the stocks, so it's something that we're doing good. You know, if you're beating the market, you're doing something good and that's what we are doing good. And we're also covering our, our ourselves as well by still upping our investments with uh, NEO, with Tesla, with our EV pie, with our green energy pie, with our growth pie. Um, I'm in over a lot of um, instruments in my portfolio, so I, I'm covering myself, my patrons, um, and if you're giant, I won't be overloading them with too much um, instruments, um, just the ones that I do really see in the next 12 months or so and given the fact that we're in a bearish market in the stock market right now it's something to consider and um, moving forward crypto assets is a huge um take in for us right now uh, cryptocurrency as well we're in various coins that are beating the market a couple of them you saw them they were, were fully fully green and they're continuing to be green uh, while there is a bit of a sell-off going on there with the top 10 so guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and we talk about stocks, 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 but if you love crypto, you like making money, you got to click the link in the subscribe box down below, guys, get off the Patreon, and guys, until next time, let's make money.